sort of had a confrontation along Centennial and Park Drive. And we do see armored vehicles. What we don't see is riot gear. Atlanta police officers did not come to this dressed in riot gear. Um, they came here to sort of monitor and, again, do their jobs as this uh, demonstration and rally and march was taking place. But if you see these officers, um, certainly a different approach by the department uh, to not come out in full riot gear. Um, that, that was not the expectation here. The expectation was that these officers would just be patrolling um, this march and rally and, uh, and demonstration scheduled for downtown Atlanta. We want to go to Channel 2's Matt Johnson now. He is also down there along Centennial Olympic Park. Matt, unless you've moved positions, fill us in. Yeah, we had to kind of get out of the fray there after getting swarmed by some of the protesters. But we're back down here um, on Centennial Olympic Park Drive in Marietta, but a little bit close to another barricade, which is down here. Uh, police are not letting anybody at the bottom end here get anywhere near uh, State Farm Arena or the, or the CNN Center. And as of course you know, we just came from that other barricade. So we're seeing a lot of people walking back from that initial barricade by CNN Center saying, you know, I just got maced, it's crazy up there, but a lot of people are leaving. So this could be winding down. Um, there is, the, you know, like Richard and Mark have said, there's definitely two protests going on because this is extremely aggressive at times. and. Where, uh, where, where we spend most of the day was incredibly peaceful. So it's disheartening for a lot of organizers, I'm sure, to see what's going on up there. But thankfully, nobody has been seriously hurt. And we have just seen uh, one person led away in handcuffs. But uh, we'll kind of monitor the situation. It's definitely died down compared to when the tensions were extremely hot, when people were jumping on top of police cars, when mace was being deployed on a lot of people. So we'll keep an eye on it and uh, keep you updated in this newscast, Joe Vita. So, um... That's the latest from Atlanta, and as more information comes in, it will be posted as video, and it'll go to the Zinni 62 on YouTube channel, as well as Oakland News Now, Oak.com, Oakland News Online.com, Oakland Focus.com, Atlanta Focus.com, San Francisco Focus.com, 16 of the blogs, and the 98 blog, Zinni 62 blog network. So subscribe to Zenny62 on YouTube and bookmark oaklandnewsnow.com.